Uh, this video will show you how to change transaction numbers on sales forms like invoice number, sales receipt, uh, like that. So I'm on home page screen here. Uh, this is uh, invoice. So right now you don't see any invoice number in here and you want to customize your own invoice number. All right, so go to company gear right here, company gear, company settings, sales, and custom transaction number. You should just check this box. So this is the one you want. Let's use own numbering system. If left blank invoice numbers are automatically assigned by QuickBooks. So this one is on now. And save it. Now go to invoice. So it'd be invoice, uh, credit memo, sales receipt, and refund receipt. Uh, so click invoice. So right now it's 50,002. And you like the other way, something different. Let's say QBO dash uh, 2001. Like this way. So let's create one invoice. Okay, I can save this now so you can guess uh, how this will uh, populate this number in sequence for next transaction. So save this one, save a new. So the next one is uh, it's a uh, uh, 2002, the QBO dash 2002. So, uh, uh, so that's our new transaction. We'll auto populate uh, a new number in sequence in QuickBooks Online. Uh, and let's say you don't like this one, you want to change it. Let's say uh, I dash 2001, like this. The same thing. Save a new. Okay, so right here. So uh, now, if you want to create sales receipt, uh, let's say uh, another one here. Sales receipt right here. It will be one I dash 2002. Okay, so you will see the same number in here. And credit memo, the same number. See. And also refund receipt. So, and uh, once uh, you like the uh, sequence, uh, you know you don't want to leave that open. Someone may just, uh, you know, by mistake change the number, then you lose the sequence again. So go back to the company settings and sales, and turn this off now. Oh, not that one. This one, it's off. Now, you can create the in create your invoice. And save it. So if you look at the preview, although you don't you don't see it anymore. Now there's a sequence now. See right here. Okay, that's that's all. So that's what you have to do. Thank you for watching and uh, subscribe to our YouTube channels. We have two channels, BP Controller and New QBO. Like us on Facebook. Thank you. Bye.